In this week's Torah portion, we read a very famous line, V'achalta v'savata uverachta, You shall eat, be satisfied, and bless. It is a line that is incorporated into the Birkat HaMazon, and it is a line that is incorporated into the Talmudic discussion about saying a blessing after a meal. However, the rabbis note that the order of the words in the phrase from the Torah are very interesting. You should eat, be satisfied, and then bless. The implication of the statement is that if you eat and are not satisfied, you do not have to bless. To which the rabbis come back and say, well, that is technically true. What this verse from the Torah lays down for us is the challenge. The challenge that whatever we partake, whatever we consume from this world, that we find some way to be satisfied, which is to say, some way that we are able to feel a sense of gratitude, even if we are not completely full after the experience. This is a challenge for all of us who seek to find holiness in everyday life, both in terms of the things that we consume and the way that we experience our world. Our challenge is to find even the smallest of things for which we can be grateful, and in that sense, bless those things, and in blessing those things, come to a sense of feeling blessed ourselves. And that, my friends, is your Torah in two.